Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome in our next class of a Microsoft Excel. In previous video, we have learned about a very simple formulas. Maximum, minimum and average. We get uh, the maximum, minimum and the average of a class with the marks. And we had a very simple formulas. And we applied the determinant relations over there. Today, we will make a complete we will make a complete result card over here okay <clears throat> you forget about that what we have written over here I'm going to remove it and it is not more over the fifth class now I will say that it is the 10th grade get the same names delete the formulas okay now here I will draw the subject like um, physics math biology chemistry and we'll say the English literature Islamic studies okay I have one two three four five and six I have six subjects over here and here I will say the total okay I'll get the total of a person then we'll manipulate the other things okay like the early I'm giving the marks out of the hundred and each and every person we have the total of the 600 and we'll get the, uh, the six subjects and we'll get the 600 marks and here yeah, I'll just get the physics I'll enter the physics marks he, he get the he get the 65 uh, he's a strong in the math and get the 75 is a losing of in the bio get the 52 normal in the chemistry get the 59 Yes, it has a good English, you get the 85, and has a good knowledge in Islamic history. So, you get, you get the 86. Okay. So, 65, 75, 52, 59, 85, and 86, you got the marks. So, I want to get that. How many marks did he get? Okay. I just want to get the how many marks you get. So I'll apply the formula is equal to sum. And I will enter the range as we did in the last video. I can enter the manual range like this, or I can enter the range by entering the digit. Like C4 colon H4. It is a gentle practice because when you have a bigger sheets you cannot enter the manually you cannot move the, cross, move the cursor all over the, cross, the sheet it became very difficult so it is a common and general practice that we will just add it by manually entering the c4 and at six i've entered you get the 42 uh, 422 marks okay that's great Now in the next, I get to go to the next uh, the physics. Now you get the 45 in it, you get the 56 in it, you get the 75 in it. In the chemistry, you got the 84. In English, you got the 42. Or in Islamic studies, you got the 75. Okay. Then here are the two simple ways. I'll Enter the manually, get sum, and I will give the number in the C5 to H5. Another side. 
C5 to H5. You got to hit enter, and he'll get the number. So every time I'll just wrote it. So it became very difficult if I had a large number. If I had a large number of the students, now I have the 10, I can easily wrote each and every person's marks in here. So what should I do that each uh, that I should I should get rid of each and every number? So I will just I enter the first formula. I will enter the first formula and then I'll drag it up to the tenth level. Now he added itself. Now he just wrote the zero 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 because I haven't entered any number in the next. Okay, so thirteen H thirteen. It is the C9 H9 because it is in the ninth series. And whenever I get, the, I enter the marks over here. It will wrote that he will sum up every person over here. Now I haven't added the next person's marks yet, but I just want to make, I want to ensure that my maximum, my minimum, and my average should be uh, should be uh, continuously attaching, attached over here, and. I get the I get the marks. I get the maximum mark. I get the minimum marks. I get the average, real timely. Whenever I enter even a single digit in here. Okay. And so we'll apply the max formula. Is equal to max. I select the range of the total that I want to get. That who is getting the maximum marks? So what is our maximum digit in over here? So in here, I want to get the minimum. So. I'll go to not go to this time the manually I will enter in like uh, I4 to I13 4 to I13 I'll get the minimum number so it is the zero so I want to get the average again I'll go to the average and I'll wrote the I it is I4 to I 13 okay now it is taking the average giving me the average okay get me it's giving me the average okay so here I want to apply the formula that it, I get the total of the person it is a 422 and now I want to get that the maximum that how much you get the max it is the max the maximum marks and what did he get the minimum marks next the percentage what the percentage did that the student get so maximum marks minimum marks and the percentage I'll get the, all these this stuff over here the maximum it is the same I get the max and then I'll go through um, it is the C4 this time C4 to the H Four, okay. I want. I got the max. Okay. And uh, I should have to get the average, average of the each each subject that I should get that the what is the average of the person now in each subject. Okay. Uh, and the minimum, I'll go to the same way. Minimum. Okay. Like that. And only hit enter. I get the minimum marks. Okay. Percentage. Before I'm going to percentage, I'll get the average. Now, this one once again. What will be the average of my uh, student? Uh, I can enter manually like this. Hit enter, I get the average. Now, let's go. It is uh, critical the percentage. I'll click over here. I just go to the formula bar. Is equal to the percentage uh, do you know what is the formula of the percentage it is the uh, the obtained marks over total marks 
multiplied by 100 okay obtained marks now I have the obtained marks over here here this is my obtained mark so my obtained mark is I 4 over uh, the 600 I have total marks of the 600 multiplied by 100 obtained marks over total marks I, I parenthesize it I parenthesize it in the center and multiplication with the hundred is the after the parentheses because it will divide um, the I fourth value with the 600 first and then it will multiply it with the hundred now I get okay 70 per, uh, 70 per 30 double 30 it is the uh, the percentage percentage of the person out of the hundred and it has the average average is also same because I am getting the whole marks from the hundred so the average and the percentage will be the same at the scenario out of this formulas I'll go to down and apply everything applied my whole formulas to the all my worksheet okay now I'll get started I'll wrote I'll do, uh, start writing the numbers uh, here's the 74 or 52 uh, 65 or 58 you know are you watching that uh, the min average is continuously calculating and is calculating um, the total of the person and making the backs and minimum and the you know the percentage and the average the percentage is 41 but the average is 62 because the percentage is the out of the hundred because when I will complete it it will show me the, f uh, the perfect number here in English you get the 56 and uh, you get the 78 marks in the Islamic studies okay now now I get it you may see that you may see that here my average the average of the uh, the whole students is 018 but here we have continuously we got the real time multiple uh, with the real time the total marks max minimum and the percentage and the average okay now come to the next okay this 14 marks 54 marks 42 65 okay and 52 again Islamic study got got the 56 now we have the all the figures okay so it is a better uh, he's a shining student 85 74 or uh, 65 in chemistry got the 84 got the English over the 82 grade and it is the 96 96 and they get uh, 487 marks out of the 600 so it has the percentage and the average once again 42 15 or get this or 45 or 63 or 52 or fifth or they are good to go the 51 yeah I'll get, get I'll just entering other manual numbers that whatever are, are all in my mind I just taking all that so just come to the next uh, the 74 54 86 95 54 75 okay I getting the real time I getting the everything in the real time that my my average my maximum marks you know I've just as as the enter the 47 487 and I get them I updated the 487 over here and my average is 264 over here now 35 you know I, you you must be watching over there that the, everything will be updated right accordingly 52 sorry 52 okay 85 uh, 49 54 75 okay now there are only two two students left 75 95 65 42 74 85 
Okay, let me get the last one. Uh, he get the seventy four. You know, the here, here the minimum is updated because uh, this is this is not the zero anymore. Minimum is also updated. We get the fifty two. Now it is updated again. Seventy four. 85 75 95 now I've completed my sheet I have completed my sheet now you can see that that the total it is a total out of 600 of each and every student I got there the maximum person got the 487 marks minimum person got the 268 marks and the average of our student is 388 yeah, yeah, right. Here is the student got the 86 maximum, 52 minimum marks. Percentage is 70.33 and average is 70.33. Average in the percentage is the same because we're getting the average and we can get in the percentile from the 100. We both have the max of the 100, so we'll get the same. Okay, so don't worry. We'll try another sheet. Uh, we'll do just another manipulation. You will get the difference. Okay. Uh, this student, the Asad. I said that the 84 maximum, 42 minimum, so 62 the percentage, and each and every student have the maximum marks, have the minimum marks, have the percentage that he get out of the 100, and has the average of the each and every uh, every subject that he got. So here are the maximum marks that the student get, the minimum mark that the student get, and the average of this class. Okay, guys, uh, uh, for the now. Um, and our uh, today's lecture is concluded. We just learned that some formula in it. We learned the percentage. That how we get the percentage in it. Okay, we we'll get the average formula in it. Uh, we just try the percentage formula manually, and we try the average sum and the maximum and minimum formula. Uh, that uh, it is all. We get the the predefined functions of the Microsoft Excel. Okay, inshallah, in the next video we'll try something new we'll try more manipulations of the data and we'll get some new formulas over there we'll see you in the next video allah hafiz